The WA Liberal Party has appointed its first female leader after a messy leadership switch. Lisa Harvey takes over from Mike Nahan, despite earlier denials about a secret plan to make the change. Meet the new Liberal leadership team. Just 24 hours after MPs said nine news reports of a backroom plan to swap Mike Nahan for Lisa Harvey before the next election were a beat up. Fake news, now undeniable fact. Look, I'm not going to go over the events of the last week. Uh, suffice to say, Mike did not consult with me before he uh, resigned. Then this frank admission about the botched transition. It's been somewhat chaotic, uh, which is a bit regrettable. I think someone would have liked me to stay on, at least for a while longer. But uh, this is a decision I made and I think it's the right one. Any hope of a smooth transition crumbled when details were leaked to the media and Dr Nahan decided enough was enough. He didn't want to be the patsy anymore and decided to bring the leadership issue to an abrupt head. This is a decision that I made with my wife and myself. His colleagues in denial yesterday were in shock today as they arrived at Parliament to elect a new leader. Jeez, I've, I've learned a lot. <laughs> Jeez, yes. But this is apparently how it's done. Yeah, the numbers game. Even Party Secretary Nick Garan was blindsided. I had no idea. The first I knew about it was when I was asked to go into Mike's office at 6.30. After a short party room meeting... I'm the first female uh, state leader of the parliamentary Liberal team and I'm really proud to uh, be, be the first woman elected into that role. Elected unopposed. While her new deputy, Nedlands MP Bill Marmion, insists he wasn't preparing to retire. I still play hockey and, uh, in fact, our team's on top. A new team in place. Uh, Leader of the Opposition. Thank you, Mr Speaker. With your indulgence, I advise the House that early... Let the games begin. ...elected unopposed. Well, let's bring in Gary Adshead now. Gary, what's your take on this new team? Well, it's been a heck of a 48 hours, let's just say that. But, Michael, as you know, whenever there's a switch to a new leader in politics, everyone is watching to see how they perform. And, uh, of course, Lisa Harvey will be under the microscope and adding to that pressure will be the other harsh reality of politics. There's always someone around you who thinks they could do a better job. This might not be the final leadership switch we see before the 2021 election. Michael. Interesting times ahead. Gary, thank you.